This is Billy Cox, I'm the Utah Girls Wrestling Director, and we're talking uh, today about the opportunities for girls. Today, uh, we're talking about wrestling, which is the fastest high school sport uh, in the country right now for girls. Um, there's n numerous opportunities for these girls. There's uh, every year the college growth, uh, it goes up two or three, where, which means that uh, scholarships that are uh, being unused because girls don't know of the opportunities. Uh, this year we've had at least three new colleges, which uh, it ansets is uh, 27 new scholarships for girls. Uh, we're talking about changing family cultures, uh, college, uh, girls that uh, family members have never gone to college. We now have uh, girls going to college for the first time, uh, seeing the dream of going to the Olympics, uh, uh, going to Worlds. Um, right now we're at, we're at the kind of a grassroots here in Utah. We have uh, probably around 100 girls right now uh, statewide, and we're giving them opportunities um, to, like here at State, to have their own division. Um, this year we've seen um, a huge growth in girls participating in high school sports, but uh, also just the, our youth super state. This year we had a record number, we had uh, over 50 girls um, at Youth Super State for the girls division. Um, and then uh, on top of that, we're promoting these girls to go national. So we want them to go to Western Region. We want to go to uh, Western Juniors in Vegas, to Body Bar, and of course to Fargo, which is our national championship. This year, uh, Utah may have the opportunity uh, with the number of girls to have their very first um, full team um, dual team for females. And um, it's, it's a great time. Uh, to see the growth, to see these girls grow, to see that uh, uh, they're stepping outside of the box, and uh, also the growth in the parents. Uh, we're, we're changing these cultures and uh, letting them, you know, teaching them good habits, and uh, and they're going to end up being great uh, women in the future, and great leaders in our community, and, and great parents. And uh, so that's what we're teaching: be, be comfortable with your own skin. So, uh, hopefully. Uh, this really grows and we're able to uh, just keep it growing and keep these girls uh, learning.